You're watching America This Morning, America's number one early morning news. And now to the morning's other top story, the Super Bowl weekend kickoff. The teams are ready, the fans are gearing up, and the toughest security plan ever is in place. ABC's Tamon Bradley joining us live from outside of MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford, New Jersey. Good morning, Tamon. John and Marcy, fans here in New Jersey and New York are ready for some football. It will be a Super Bowl like no other. Everybody here is ready to make history. The first outdoor cold weather Super Bowl is now only hours away. Fans are fired up. It's the Seattle Seahawks versus the Denver Broncos, the best defense versus the best offense. So I'd like to help help the Broncos uh, um, get another championship, and uh, but you have other people that you'd like to win it for as well. I mean, we go after it at all times, and I think that's why our offense is one of the best at keeping it, and we're one of the best at getting it. Here at MetLife Stadium in New Jersey, final preparations are underway. Earlier in the week, crews cleared snow. Sunday's game time forecast is mild in the mid to high 30s. Our game is to experience the elements. It's part of what we do. It's part of football. New York City has transformed Broadway into Super Bowl Boulevard. Large crowds are enjoying concerts and greeting NFL players past and present. An unprecedented security plan is in full effect. Bomb-sniffing dogs, fighter jets in the sky, helicopters, and high-speed boats in the water with radiological detection and infrared sensors. Every delivery to the stadium is getting a police escort. No specific terror plot has been identified, but officials say they're leaving nothing to chance. The FBI is also on alert, on the lookout for any lone wolf actors, like the two brothers accused of bombing last April's Boston Marathon. An event like this, you know, the person that we, we don't know about, who comes out of nowhere, who wants to make a statement. I mean, that's what we're really concerned about. The FBI has done thousands of background checks on stadium workers, from the people who clean up all the way to the people selling concessions, Marcy and John. All right, Taman Bradley, live at MetLife Stadium in New Jersey. Thank you.